the Perth Gold Cup is next up, and it's a 0 to 140 handicap. Is the Perth Gold Cup, and it's the top one is reality check for Ryan Tamasevi. Simon's Wood for Darren Thompson, Winged Respect for David Robertson, Bonjour Paul Rhodes, Junk in the Trunk Ages, David Robertson, Resentful Sadie, James Shea, Astro Charm, Glances, Martin Lidham, Gypsy King, Alex Cherry, Court Marlette, Graham Clutterbuck, Tullamore Sloan, Daniel French, Big Fat Truth, Craig Beckwith, Rizwan Kalai for Vinnie Gerard, Radia for David Hooley, Annie Walker, and Danzig Karamoff, Thomas Rogers, and nothing much. Much for Ryan Costello calling in away and off towards the first of the fences. It's a big ditch and over it they go. We've lost one already. Rezwan Kalawi was a faller at the very first fence then. So Rezwan Kalawi is out of the Perth Gold Cup as they race down towards the second of the 19 fences and it's Radia who is in the lead for David Hooley. Gypsy King is second as they get to the second. And over it they go, mistake towards the back there by Resentful Sadie, but she got away with it. And Radia has settled down into a clear lead jockey, having a look around, see how far in front he is. And he's already five lengths clear of Big Fat Truth and Reality Check. And Gypsy King and Court Milet, the two David Rawson horses together, junk in the trunk ages and winged respect. Racing down to the next, this is the water jump. I've got two complete circuits on the track to go now. And Radia will swing right handed with a lead of five lengths to Gypsy King in second, who's just about to be taken on the inside by Bonjour. Then comes Reality Check in fourth. Astro Charm glances the grey, he's in fifth. Then comes Annie Walker and Court Marlette, and we respect and nothing much with Danzig Caraman after that one. Then Simon's Wood as they get to the fifth. They're all safely over the fifth with Big Fat Truth. Now the back marker just dropped back a little bit, but Radia is set at a good pace in his sixth clear. Oh, bonjour in second. Gypsy King on his outside third. Bit of a gap to Reality Check and Astro Charm glances the grey. Then Annie Walker and Wood Respect with tucked in behind them Court Milet. Simons Wood is wide on the track as they get over that ditch, which they're all safely over. Looking towards the back junk in their trunk ages is also towards the back of the field, that's the grey towards the back. Big fat truth still the back marker as they get over number seven. Which they're all safely over. And they're quite well strung out with Radia sitting at a strong pace. Leading by a good seven or eight lengths to Bonjour in second. And then Gypsy King and Reality Check. Astro Charm glances and Annie Walker and Wing Respect. And caught my lets after that one. Simon's Wood wide. Resentful Sadie on the rail as they get over number eight. And all safely over that one as well with nothing much now dropping towards the rear. The Radia is well clear. Bonjour. Reality check in the red on the outside. Gypsy King just dropped back to fourth. Astro Charm glances moving up on the outside as they take that ditch. Which they're all safely over. Tullamore Sloan is tucked in. Mid-division one we've not mentioned yet, but it's Radia who's in the lead. Coming to the 10th and over it they go. All safely over that one. With Radia in front. Only about four and a half lengths up now, now on reality check as we just lose them behind the trees momentarily. Astro Child glances made a mistake while we weren't looking. And Radia is the leader. From reality check and bonjour. Gap back to Annie Walker. And then we respect and resentful Sadie and Astro Charm glances and Gypsy King as they take the water then for the final time past the winning post and now swing out for one more circuit of this Perth track. And Radia is clear. Then only by three now to Bonjour in second. Reality check is a length and a half back in third. Another couple of lengths back to Annie Walker and then Resentful Sadie and Astro Charm glances and Gypsy King as they get over number 13. Nothing much is now the back marker as they pass the mile pole. With Radia and they led all the way so far. Likes to front run this one. Are they going to catch him? Reality check is second. Bonjour is third. And Resentful Sadie and Annie Walker. Astra Charm glances and Gypsy King. Simons would now making a forward move. They get over that ditch and Simons would has fallen just as he was making a move forward. He's crashed out of the race and he really looked like he was coming through to make a significant 
play a significant part in the race there. The one that's doing that now is Wing Respect. He got over that one okay, although he jumped a little bit slowly. But it's Radia in the lead. From Wing Respect coming round the outside. Gypsy King trying to keep the prize in Scotland is third. Then Bonjour after that one. Caught my let's trying to get into it as well. They're bunching up up top. There's plenty in with chances here. I wouldn't rule much out of this as they come down towards the fourth from home. And it's Rod here who lands over in the lead, but a better jump by Wing Respect who goes second. Annie Walker now throws down a big challenge on the inside third. Then comes Court Marlette and Bonjour after that one. And then Gypsy King resentful. Sadie Astro Charm glances trying to get into it. So too is Danzig Caramel. Big Fat Truth and he's also coming there as well as they get over the third from home. And over the third last, it's Radia, who's still in the lead. For Ali Walker and Gypsy King, then Bonjour, Wing Respect, Big Fat Truth running on, then comes Resentful Sadie. There's plenty in with the chances here as they come down towards the second last, and there's still about a dozen that could win it. Over the second last they go, and it's Gypsy King in front from Ali Walker, and Radia is still there, trying to battle onto his Wing Respect. They're coming down towards the final fence then now, over it they go, it's Gypsy King in the lead, and a crashing through there for Radia. It's Gypsy King for Ali Walker, Big Fat Truth and Resentful Sadie, Gypsy King's in the lead by half a length. Gypsy King in front. Gypsy King being pressed again by Annie Walker. Annie Walker's beginning to get up. And Annie Walker calls time on the Perth Gold Cup. Annie Walker wins it. And Gypsy King and Bonjour and then Court Marlette and Big Fat Truth from all the slow ran on. Nothing much trout in last. And the long time leader right here crashed out at the final fence. But Annie Walker. Second season horse, that one gets a big win to close the season off. And Annie Walker takes it for Thomas Rogers off a featherweight bottom weight. Gypsy King for Alex Cherry couldn't quite keep the prize in Scotland. Resentful Sadie for James Shea was third. Bonjour for Paul Rose was fourth. And Court Marlette for Graham Clutterbuck was fifth. <laughs>